What up everybody, this is your boy Black Megas and it's kind of funny because at the time I'm recording this, about two hours ago, I published a video where I discussed the rumors of the upcoming Assassin's Creed, how there were possibly going to be two different games, one for Xbox One and PS4, the other is going to be developed solely for the um, 360 and PS3, and all that, there were pictures that um, had came out, Kotaku had them that showed the, you know, PS4, Xbox One version, images that showed that, you know, it's going to be set in, like, the French Revolutionary era, and they sh displayed a lot of um, French landmarks to, you know, corroborate that. You saw, like, Notre Dame, things like that. So, you know, I was just lamenting over the fact that we're just getting all these crazy rumors. They've been talking about it for so long. First, it was like Russia. And then you had the people speculating that it would be in Japan. It was just like, yo, what's, you know, it was, I was just lamenting over how crazy it is that we continually keep hearing these rumors. And, you know, it's like, I, I just want something solid. I was just wanting to hear something solid and tired of the speculation. I just needed to, you know, for Ubisoft to hurry up and, like, you know, announce something. Normally, they announce stuff, like, around April, I believe, because that's usually, that's, if I remember, um, that's what they did for AC3 and for AC4. Well, I guess they must have... You know, decided, you know, we, we aren't going to wait. People have already been talking about this. And it's been, quote unquote, leaked already. Making me think that um, Ubisoft did this on purpose and gave Kotaku the, you know, nod with those pictures. Because they knew they were going to come with something soon. And sure enough, we get a, a little teaser that showed alpha footage of Assassin's Creed Unity. Now, is this going to be the final um, title of it or not? I don't know. Maybe, maybe not. Who knows? But it dropped on Ubisoft's um, website. It's on Ubisoft UK and um, Ubisoft, the American uh, website. So I'm going to put the link in the description so you guys can see. But, you know, you get a little panoramic shot of um, what looks like, you know, you see the protagonist who's cloaked in black uniform as he was in the pictures standing over a large crowd i'm assuming this crowd is standing in the middle of like a square during an event that is probably significant in the french revolution i'm not like it's big of a history person that i am I'm not that familiar with the details of the French Revolution. So, you know, anybody who out there who knows, let me know. I will be very curious to see, you know, what was the significance of this shot. Because you see him um, standing in front of a cathedral. And he's looking down on a large car out in the square. They're surrounding a guillotine. Um... The guillotine looks like it's about to drop. I'm looking at the video now. That's why I know. It's only a like minute and eight seconds. But you see the guillotine drops. And then you see they show the logo for Assassin's Creed Unity. Available holiday 2014. Now what's cool is that this version is also going to be on PC. So that's good. They're not going to like snake PC people. Like we've seen people do with games before. You know. Um, remember how there was a kind of you know upheaval with NBA 2K how you know they put out the PC version and it was basically just a port of the PS3 Xbox 360 version and then you got the PS4 Xbox One version it was like extremely you know <laughs> better than the PC version so good to see that like well I guess now that the consoles are out PC will always get day and date and they'll always get a better version of it the full you know version of it you could say for pc people but cool i'm excited of course i'm an assassin's creed fan i've played them all need to finish four i may finish liberation on the vita if i could get through without the file corrupting i'd have to start the game all over again and i'm not looking forward to that because i was on sequence five and i was i'm pretty sure i was pretty much coming to the close of that game but you guys check out the trailer let me know what you think are you excited for another assassin's creed are you sick of it like a lot of people are i know a lot of people don't want 
to see another one. They want them, you know, and I don't blame you. I wish they didn't do them annually myself, but at the same time, I love those games that much that I could roll with it. But, you know, hopefully, you know, they'll just keep improving. I mean, after all, they produce these things like two years in advance. They put a different team on it to start, you know, the game two years before the, you know, one that comes out the year that um the next generation comes out it it's a weird cycle but they seem to have perfected it well so hey who knows hopefully this turns out turns out pretty well but anyway hit me up let me know what you think i'll holler at you later this your boy black makers i'm out y'all deuces